So with hundreds of candidates and measures on the ballot, things can get confusing. Many voters worry as they vote on these races. Some of the races have these Superior Court judges, for example. They don't know a lot about those candidates running. So joining us now to talk about a useful voter guide that you can get. It's been released by Reform California is the group's chairman, Carl DeMaio. Hi, Carl. Good to see you. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for having me on, Logan. We know each election year you put together this voter guide. Very helpful. Tell me how you compile it and what voters can look for in it. Well, it's available right now online at San Diego election guide.org San Diego election guide.org. And it basically looks at all the candidate races, all the ballot measure races and the judge races. And we look at candidate positions, judge positions, even their rulings uh, in various court cases. Um, we provide a plain English description of the ballot measures so that there's no confusing titles that the politicians use to uh, deceive us or confuse us. And on the candidate races, we look at people who are opposed to tax increases, people who support school reform, uh, people who support the police and law enforcement. And we've uh, graded candidates and made the recommendations based on those criteria on the judges we've looked at those judicial decisions to make sure that we have judicial candidates that are gonna respect the constitution and follow the law, not legislate from the bench. So those are all spelled out online at San Diego election guide.org. But we also wanna make sure people have confidence when they vote. Elizabeth's uh, report that you just ran there is a really good descriptor of the key dates and the process. Um, I want people to know that everybody is going to get a mail-in ballot. And so if you don't get a mail-in ballot by this Thursday or Friday, something is wrong. Uh, and you'll have to contact the Registrar of Voters Office. We also want people to know that they should trust the mailing process, the uh, U.S. Postal Service, to return the ballot because they can track their ballot online at sdvote.com. And we've got the various information on how you can track your ballot also on our website, San Diego election guide.org. Um, but it's important that you look for your ballot in the mail. Some people already got their ballot uh, on Saturday. Logan, I got my ballot. Hmm. My partner, Jonathan did not get the ballot. We both usually get the ballot at the same time. So I'm sure that his ballot will arrive today, tomorrow or Wednesday. Uh, and so when your ballot arrives, Make sure that you consult the voter guide at San, Di San Diego election uh, You can vote by mail and track it, as I described. Or, as Elizabeth just mentioned, there are a number of very convenient polling centers open all throughout San Diego County where people can personally drop off their ballot if they don't trust the Postal Service. One final thing, Logan. If for some reason your ballot uh, is destroyed or it doesn't arrive, uh, or you track your ballot that you mailed in and it doesn't show that it was received and counted, say after two or three weeks, you can still go to any of those polling centers. And I encourage you to do it before election day so there's no long lines, but go to any of those polling centers that Elizabeth was talking about in her package uh, previously. Uh, and you can demand a second ballot. It's called a provisional ballot. And they will make sure that they count only one of your ballots. But this way, if something happens and it doesn't register as being received and counted, you get a second bite at the apple uh, by going to any of those polling centers. Uh, yeah. And those are open uh, throughout the county well in advance of Election Day and including on Election Day. Carl, let me quickly ask you about this barbecue, beer and ballots. These are events that uh, you and your team put on uh, throughout the county. That's right. Thanks for asking about it. These are free events. They're fun. Barbecue, beer, and ballots. Who can turn down barbecue and beer? We ask that you help turn out the vote by inviting your friends, your family members, your neighbors to attend any of these events. We're doing them throughout San Diego County and virtually every part of the county. People can go online to register for this free event and get more information on details at reformcalifornia.org. That's reformcalifornia.org. Or they also can access it at san diego election guide.org. All right. Lots of websites. We've got them on the screen there. We'll have them on KUSI.com, of course. Carl DeMaio, good to see you, Carl. Thank you. Thanks, Logan.